after doing this film, are you interested to work in the other language film in Bangladesh again? I'll start with, uh, yes, this has been a wonderful experience and uh, the results you've seen, I've absolutely enjoyed it and treasured it. And all thanks to Ritu and the entire team because, like, as you rightly said, this is my first Bengali film. And if there is still a misconception, I am a South Indian. <laughs> I speak Tulu. I, I don't know Bengali at all. So this meant a lot, a lot of concentration, a lot of getting familiar with a new language. And uh, it's with complete support of the director, all the assistant directors, the cast. Thank you so much for making it so uh, so uh, easy and uh, memorable for me. And uh, thereby making it possible for me to become Vinodini without letting a language uh, really stress the actor in me. And um, about whether this... Okay, and, and, and in my first Bengali film, I could have asked for a better combination than Ritu as the director and uh, Rabindranath Tagore as a subject and Vinodini as a character. It is absolutely special and uh, I really, really treasure this. About doing more uh, films in different languages, I was hoping I'd already made that statement when I did my first film, Iruvar, which was in Tamil, which was in a different language, rather what you guys dub as regional cinema. But I prefer not to um, divide cinema as regional, parallel, commercial. For me, it is just really uh, be about being an actor, learning, growing with every experience, and giving to it as I learn from every experience. And so um, I've always been open to working in different languages. And about working in more Bengali films uh, with positive response, if there be. <laughs> And a lot of encouragement and support, yes, God willing. Yeah. Change okay. as if any did you make in the original story of Tagore and uh, uh, what were the changes, why were the changes necessitated? Like, could you comment on the changes if any that you were oh, who, where are you? I can't see you. Okay. Ah, okay. <laughs> Kirsten trying to put a face to the voice, as we all do, including dubbing. <laughs> but uh, while we're on the topic, um, Yes, I, I do uh, agree with you that when you dub for your own film, uh, it, it does, it, it, it's a wonderfully complete experience. But uh, from what Ritu, it was Ritu's decision on uh, having a couple of us not dub for our own, uh, for, for ourselves. Uh, I, I know why, because he gave me the reason, but I think it would be best if he answered that himself. Uh, my understanding of it was, yes, he definitely wanted the more uh, purer, uh, it's, it's set 100 years ago and uh, in a lay person's language, I mean, I understood it as you want to move, it's like Sanskritized Bengali, it should pure Bengali and making the kind of perfectionist filmmaker that he is, he wouldn't have wanted intonations to become the topic of a film when you eventually watch it. So definitely he got that, he got a couple of us dubbed by um, others. And um, at the same time, it, is, it, it still feels like an absolutely complete and fulfilling experience when I view it. I don't feel uh, any, any different, or I, I don't feel, it's been so beautifully done, I don't feel like it's another voice speaking there, and that isn't me as I, I, I performed in, in the part. So uh, it's, it's a wonderful, wonderful job.